Okay, All right. so uh, another episode of uh, Werewolf the Apocalypse. Before we get into the game proper, Jackalore, I have mm -hmm. two gifts for you. No. First of all, the flaw, Taint no. of Corruption. <laughs> uh, Wait, it's a seven. Have to pick them up? Yes. You get a seven Do point I? flaw, Taint of Corruption, because you botched like six times on related rolls. <laughs> but I will give you this you have the uh, spirit uh, background for Banes at five points. They now see you as one of their <laughs> own. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> so if you ever oh, need to talk to Bane again, you can now talk to them. God damn it. <laughs> they will give you gifts at, the, you know, at a friend price. Convincing a Bane to grant you a gift, like normally without spirit speech and due to the fact that they're assholes, it would be like a difficulty 9. For you, it's a 4. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> That's of course taking into account that you're still technically al allied with Gaia, which makes it hard as well. <laughs> so, for normal will or convincing one of them to help you, that's very hard. Not quite impossible, but close. For you, it's easy. Now all you need to do is figure out how to pick up spirit speech, and then you can actually uh, convince Bane-infested doors to let us pass. You know... You, you no longer have to cast Fist to open doors properly. You could talk to the next door you meet and convince it to give you the gift of spirit speech. <laughs> I think I made Jack Lord sad. <laughs> Maybe. You. Wow. Rude. They gave you gifts and this is your reaction? Jackalore, come now. You know you earned this. No, I did not. <laughs> yes, you fucking did. No. How many times did you botch? I let you get away with bullshit excuses for not biting on the obvious trap. There will are consequences for fucking up that badly, even if you don't get outright corrupted. You will always have that one foot in the door. There were six fucking botches at least. Mm. So, you are heading back to Sept. Yes, yes please. I need to rest. We need to rest. Very much so. I have run out of willpower. So we kind of also funny. need to tell the Sept that we saw a pit form in the middle of the city. I mean, that kind of yeah, has, to, has to be told. Yeah. yeah, meanwhile the vampires are celebrating an unqualified crushing victory over the Sabbath. All is well in the world, there are no problems whatsoever with how they handled it. And in the meantime, the werewolves are going to return to um, to, to internal screaming intensifies dot gif. <laughs> <laughs> we were so close. No, no, we weren't. We really, really weren't. You see the that, way you that fight, the, the way that fight went, the best outcome would have been them taking down the sheriff. And killing, preferably two of the Zemitsi ambushing him, including the Elder, if possible. That would have been ideal for you. Yeah. Instead... Because that would have made the Kami pack up and leave, and then the Sabbat would be down a lot of their power. Yeah. As is... The Sheriff clutched it. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking Ventral. Clutch or kick, he clutched. Triple kill. Oh. No vehicles are manslaughter, though. So, back at the sept. Uh, as you are approaching it, you are actually met by several people, including the Shadow Lord you talked to earlier. 
Uh, they seem to be hard to the teeth. Huh. Seems like they felt something bad. Huh. They're, they're probably the squad that was sent to go hunt down the Earthbound, to be honest. Oh no, they are just waiting in your path. Okay. <laughs> Looks towards Jack. <laughs> they're all He's just... Too depressed. Just waiting there, claves at the ready, <laughs> just big ass silver weapons. You know, looking at them, give me perception empathy rolls, everyone. What difficulty? Just standard difficulty of six. They're not really hiding how they're feeling, but they are all in Krino's forms. So that's a clue. And, um, yeah. And if we don't have empathy, is that increase the difficulty? Uh, no, no empathy is a talent. basic thing. It's, okay. It's a talent, Armand. Yeah, talents don't count for that. Holy hell, the dice. Yeah. I mean... Come on, Jack. I guess I should roll as well. I feel like, you know what I feel like I should have done? Upped my intelligence, since I've been the one who's telling people, no, this is a bad plan, and I'm the one with one intelligence. <laughs> that never works in cop movies. <sighs> What's a movie? If we survive this, I should be allowed to up my intelligence, right? Sure. Can't stand because then we're resting, right? Okay, so craft arrow. They seem on edge. Lara and um, Firefang, you get the feeling that they are on edge and not entirely happy to see you. It's almost as if they are on guard or something when they see you approach. And there's a good half dozen of them there, and like one or two of the real badasses of the sept as well. Okay. <laughs> I kind of want to roll sense the worm on myself. Uh, Considering what we just came out of. You wouldn't be able to, you... Hmm. Yeah, the way smell works, you generally become attuned to yourself, so no, you won't be able to pick it up on yourself. Can I, can I do it on Jackalore at least? Sure. You can do it on all you of us. You can do it on the rest of the party. Yeah, I mean, like, at just least two generally. or three of them are also sniffing the air and not yeah. relaxing at all. Uh-huh. So I may as well fire off Sense the Worm. Uh, what difficulty? Uh, we're gonna call it a six. You know, it's it's hard to tell how deep it goes, but I don't know. Smells bad, like it's settled in somewhere. Planted a flag in a little corner of him. Hmm. Yeah. Sort of going to sigh, and um, I suppose I'll I'll, I'll say that um. I suppose this is what happens when you get a front row seat to a pit forming. Huh. Uh, do I smell? Because I was right like behind him. Are you going to use no. sense the worm? Do you have I sense don't the worm? have it. I'm asking. No. I'm asking. Do, do, do I smell to the DM, the GM? Dude. Uh, not, he was not specifically smelling you. Uh, the Shadow okay. Lord just raises a hand for you to stop. Mm -hmm. We stop? Yeah. Do not say anything. You will be separated and you will be questioned. And you better be telling the same story and telling it well. Alrighty. Fun. <laughs> So, 
if you cooperate, you are essentially taken to separate rooms with uh, silver-plated bars. <laughs> <laughs> and, well, oh, you get the idea. Yeah. yeah. My gnosis. My pitiful gnosis. No. Yeah, just assume there's enough silver piled on you that that is just temporarily drained completely. They do not want you stepping anywhere. Yep. And then they start questioning you. Jackalore. Mm -hmm. From you Wait, and so does that be our gnosis pool as well? Yes, I would no, say people... that in this case, yes. Oh, so we have zero gnosis. Great. Yes. This, like permanently. This... Not permanently. As soon as you're away from silver, you can start recovering it. Okay. Okay. So we get zero temporarily. and But when we go out, we still have zero. Basically. Yes. Essentially, yes. Mm -hmm. Because your pool is reduced completely. I'm going to say that since it's for a while, it will essentially drain your reserves as well. It just leaks out of I, you're not able to hold on to it. I assume even if this takes days, we're not regaining any willpower. Uh, generally not. Jacklor, do you have temporary willpower left? Yes, I think I have one. Okay, then I'm gonna need I do your... make sure to do that. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna need you to roll willpower at eight. Not because they're torturing you, but for guilt. Because they're asking some very pointed questions and you can see the disappointment in their eyes. Like Actually, how... I have three, uh, three points of temporary willpower left. Huh. Okay, good. Then I can proper fuck you. <laughs> no, I don't want to roll that. Uh, eight... What did you say? Six or eight? Eight. Okay. <laughs> That's a roll right there. Oh, <laughs> 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 this is feel bad roll. Okay, uh, so scary. eventually the rest of you three are cleansed after mul probably multiple sessions of cleansing and multiple sessions of questioning. You are let go, yeah. and Arman, you just walking past. You just see Jackalore tying a noose from his bed sheets. Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> wow. Stop him with you. Do you wish to say anything? Yeah, I'm gonna mention that. He's currently tying it to the bars and seeing how he can collapse to properly choke himself. <laughs> so you yeah. do not I'm have a lot right. of time. Yeah, no. Um, is there anyone else around here? Uh, there are guards nearby. Yes, within line of sight. I'm gonna sort of turn one and ask: Are you going to stop him? Wait, what is he doing now? Attempting to hang himself. Yeah, one of them rushes up, looks you in the eye, Jackalore. Then just nods and turns away and walks off. <laughs> Pity in his <laughs> eyes. <laughs> he understands. It's the only way. <laughs> Are you help? Aru, you if you're if someone's gonna save him, it's gonna have to be you. Cause the guards are like Brother, we what understand. It's the only way. Die with honor. Jackler, how much uh, did you put the book down? Can I just ask that now? You know, I'm, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to poke Coyote and ask um, whether, whether or not he feels I should intervene. I think Coyote isn't feeling well. Well, what would Coyote say here? He he's gonna say that it's up to you. He he doesn't know how to handle this kind of situation.
you know, this is actually kind of tough for me. Um, <laughs> I'm looking at my renown and I'm trying to figure out how that would affect and is whether or not oh, you're how greedy cunt. No, I'm not. I'm not looking at the renown chart. I'm looking at my personal renown, trying to figure out how my character would be acting in this situation based on everything else that's happened. You know, while yeah. Aruman is I'm taking sort of... the other yeah. two of you, okay. you are nearby and you get a ping from Coyote saying that uh, Red Fang is going to try and choke himself. Can we get it? The both of you. Or, sorry, Fire oh. Fang, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I mean, I guess we could head over there. <laughs> Just slowly. Oh no, I hope I'm not too late. I mean, he's one of my, he's one of my people, I guess, since he's ranked two. Even though he's a contra talent, I'll hurry. Okay, you're down. hurrying, Nayaxi. Sure, let's hurry. Yeah, I forget what I'm what I'm going to end up saying. So I'm sort of going to I'm sort of going to grab him, and I'm gonna I'm gonna look him. Straight straight in the eyes and say, if you wish to die with honor, then die in battle against the worm. It's, it's the only true way to redeem yourself from what's from, from what I seems to have happened. Where you roll, uh, roll charisma or something. Yeah, give me a charisma empathy check or give me a wits at seven to see how far have you gotten with the news. <laughs> so what difficulty is it? What difficulty is the roll? Uh, six. <laughs> you know, you, you're you pretty sure you have figured, like there's a crossbar near the top. If you reach just right, you can slip the noose around there. And then you could just sort of slump forward. And at that point, the weight would be off and you would probably be good to go. Yay. <laughs> All right, so what is my, does my one success help? Let's put it this way. It's a start, but you are not convinced. Clearly, he cares, but he doesn't really get it. Yeah. So, as you're... It's unwinnable. Why fight? As you're throwing the uh, <laughs> punched up sheets through the uh, uh, top there, tying them off, uh, the other two rush into the uh, cell block. <laughs> So, you rush up, and you see Firefang just, um, you know, he's looking up at the sheet he has tied off at the top, and just sort of, you can see him measuring the distances with his eyes, making sure he gets it right. Making adjustments. If, if, my, if my attempt at uh, consoling was, didn't, wasn't enough, then I'd step back. Honestly... Uh. I've made my attempt, and I, if he feels that this is the only way for him to perish with honor, then I sort of accept it. I, I've made an attempt, which is, um, well, it's more than what the guards would do, it's probably more than what he feels he deserves, so I'll, I'll leave him to what he feels is necessary. There is no honor in suicide. That's what I said, but there he didn't seem to quite accept it. Besides, there's... Besides, it's better than being a slave to the worm. I mean, you can make that uh, plea as well, Craft, if you wish. You certainly have a lot more charisma. Yeah, you'd probably be better at making that plea than uh, I would. My two charisma was a start, but others can probably do better. Charisma, expression, empathy, uh, anything? The, or the... pure charisma? For you, probably leadership to inspire him to keep fighting, honestly. Okay. Charisma leadership difficulty six? Yes. The true way to redeem yourself is to close the 
to kill the thing that tainted you. Ha! Oh. <laughs> it was my friend. It was oh, your friend. What? what did you say? He was lagging. Yeah. Why did it have to be Stonekeeper? <laughs> Nayaxi, do you want to pitch in? I mean, yeah, but I'm not quite sure what to say. Jackalore, make another wits roll at 7 to see if you're finished yet. <laughs> And <laughs> ready to go. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. You know, you just see him suddenly strike realization, drag the bed over, climb on top of it, right on the very edge, and start tying the noose off around his own neck. I mean, I'll kill yeah, that young for that. <laughs> Is that how you say, Lexi? No, 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 I just... Aren't you a bit too young to kill yourself? I mean... You can still fight, you can still come back from this. He was your friend, then honor his memory, not honor his... Then not, uh, not what he's become, sort of thing. Okay, so you're trying to inspire him to keep fighting. I think that's a charisma leadership kind of thing, I actually, as I well. Mean, I have what I said, Aru, at least. <laughs> that's not saying much. Please don't botch. Oh, yeah, nice. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> if he botches. I mean. Well, <laughs> they suck at being convincing, Jackalore. But is we're not, a we're not a charisma party. You say that, but look at me. I had at least five dice. It's still failure. I mean, <laughs> look at all of the ones that have popped up when we're trying to prevent someone from dying. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Let Jackalor make his decision. It's one success. That is not convinced. Like, so not. I'm leaving it to up to you. I will exact appropriate permanent willpower penalties for essentially being depressed as fuck and crushed in the soul. As I said, I don't think he'd want to keep fighting, especially with those, like, one success in total. Like, <laughs> really? Really? The only person who got a success was the was also the lowest, also the lowest number of dice. This is kind of sad. Why is it that I keep rolling stupidly well on my um, when on my dice on my low dice pool things? Okay, so let's see, Jackalor. First of all, yes, I'm gonna need a uh, willpower at eight to go through with it because often yourself is a willpower roll. Oh god! Oh, god. <laughs> yeah, you see the look in his eye. It's like my body's ready as he steps forward. Let's see if your essentially really beast agrees, so give me a frenzy roll at the uh, three since I think you're not on it, it would still be the warrior's moon. The dice want him dead. Oh my god, that's hilarious. <laughs> I mean, I know that when he botched the willpower roll, that's when I was like, yeah, the dice yeah. wants him. I mean, if you look at how well he's been rolling in comparison to how we've been rolling in the whole, um, getting himself off bit. Yeah. Yeah. So that frenzy roll, Jack. <laughs> Let's see if survival instinct takes over once you start choking, essentially. I mean, does he have enough rage to even attempt? Permanent, uh, rage. No. Or yeah, you I mean, roll whichever is enough? higher. You always roll whichever is higher, Craft. 
I mean, does he have enough rage? Like, does he have enough so he can get six successes to not kill himself? He doesn't need six, he just needs four. Oh. And like I said, temporary or permanent, whichever is higher. So, Jacklor, frenzy roll, difficulty three. Yep. Oh, six. Difficulty three. What should be the? What should be another word in frenzy? Nope. Uh, you see just really a spark yeah. of rage there, and then it just goes out. Well, that was pretty pathetic. <laughs> just. He calculated it just right. His feet are just off the floor as he slowly swings as he's turning blue. And it's taking a long time because this is essentially bashing damage as he chokes in human form while constantly healing. Would any of you like to interfere at this point? Nope, he's made, he's made his decision and, the, be and the, uh, the best thing I can do is respect it. It is not the right decision. <laughs> you know, about two minutes into this, you notice that the Shadow Lord is there, watching you. He just nods towards the door for you to go. Mm -hmm. I do not wish to see my comrade die like this. He just uh, mouths, essentially, let him die with some dignity. Yeah. I'll leave. I don't think he can die with less dignity. <laughs> <laughs> I can think of a few ways he can die with less dignity. Shoes. <laughs> okay. So. About a minute after the party has filtered out, and as you're seeing some very black spots in front of your eyes, Jackalor, uh, the Shadow Lord just standing there says, I have a way to fix you, if you'll serve me. Just nod. Can I even nod? <laughs> if, if you want to, yes, just barely. You don't have a lot of time before you pass out, though. Hmm. Hmm. What does it look like? He looks like an asshole. <laughs> Rano. Hmm. 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 Make a perception empathy at eight. Since you're dying. Yes, and it's hard to tell if this asshole is lying. I'll fucking add, <laughs> spend the temp willpower on it. Why the fuck not? <laughs> <laughs> nothing better to do. Uh, do. He yeah, you know. is stone cold honest. He knows a way. He'll make you pay for it through the nose. But at <laughs> the end of a long and grueling servitude, there's a cure to fix this. I'm considering just... RP reasons right now, but would he? I'll roll a one data. If it helps, the Shadow Lord, when he sees you're not yes. immediately I'll, I'll... going for it, would be adding things like, the cause still needs you, your pack needs you. Don't be a coward, don't take the easy way out. Yeah, I'll nod. Okay, he reaches through the bars, trying to stay away from the silver, and just slices through the uh, sheets. Pawn acquired. Yay. <laughs> God's fucking <laughs> damn it. Oh. Even if he lied, you know there's a secret roll there. There was a secret roll there, yes, Kraft. 
And he might or might not have lied through his teeth, yes. Oh my god! <laughs> lying through his teeth, I'm going out of character. I'm not sure my character would know that in character. In character, you yeah. buy it completely. Most... He got at least three successes yes. over you. Yeah, I assumed as much. He's a fucking Shadow Lord. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> If nothing else, he might be able to. He might be able to help the fucking situation better than we can. Yep. He just unlocks the cell, and Joe uh, just tells you to go to your pack and make sure that they watch you at all times because you cannot be trusted right now. I nod. Yeah, the one guard that's still there looks really uncomfortable with these happenings, but doesn't quite dare to mount off to his elder. This is the kind of shit, by the way, that gets an actual elder yelled at at a moot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Given that it's a crisis situation, he might be able to get it, get away with it with barely a ripple, but this is shady shit. Way shady. By werewolf standards. Yeah. <laughs> like, so incredibly fucking shady, it's unbelievable. So about... If he wasn't the Shadow Lord, it would be even shadier. So about five minutes later... You see Firefang just walk out of the prison. I am surprised. Very yeah. surprised. By the way, Jackalore, I am gonna have to take a permanent willpower point away from you. For the ordeal. Okay. Mostly due to the fact that you botched the first willpower roll. Otherwise, I probably would have let you get away with losing 10 points. So, it's about three days later. The vamps probably have happily started fortifying the city, found a source of silver bullets, etc. Mm-hmm. Uh, we spent three days in interrogations. Coincidentally, the one clan that had a established uh, weapons manufacturer? I think I need to pick up their we're status we're... by one for this. Hmm. So do we get three willpower back then? Uh, no, you have <laughs> been <laughs> essentially uh... interrogated throughout this. Okay. Yeah, we still need to recover. We haven't even done that yet. The only te the only spendable resource I have is two points of rage. I My no... character is in a bad way right now. Yep. I have a bit more willpower too. I mean, right now is the time to press the attack, surely. Right. Right. Because the enemy must be weak and reeling, they must not be allowed to recover. Not like we are completely fucked up, too. You are beyond fucked up. If we can send another pack to do it? Sure. Not us. You know, I'm just gonna assume that you're discussing this in um, character, and you just see four sets of ears from people who just barely passed their right of initiation a couple of months ago just perk up and look at you like, oh? Yeah, no. I just sort of shake my head. No. And I, I just sort of exactly. look at them and just shake my head. <laughs> they seek death. They look really Do disappointed. Not they can be disappointed all they fucking want, but this is not... We've, we've been barely hanging on for most of our time there. They would not do much better than we are. They would do worse. There's probably a Malk by now that's actually been 
harness despite their untrustworthiness to scry for uh, you know future bullshit yeah especially as they're the only auspex clan that hasn't been ravaged at this point <laughs> the tories are dead <laughs> Oh my goodness! Yeah, the toys are they're dead. Like... Yeah, the um, the, the <laughs> freaking um, Tremere are dead. Well, Venture don't have aspects. Yeah, there's just one or two random elders that has have varying levels of aspects, and other than that, it's just all of the Malkavians. Yep. <laughs> You're so happy with this. Oh, this is beyond fucked. <laughs> yeah. So hold on. I mean, at least we managed to burn down all of the uh, the shitty clans. Um, <laughs> uh, not really. The Malks are one of the shitty ones in terms of strength. No, not not shitty as in terms of strength, but shitty as in terms of humanity. Like in its in its entirety, mm, it varies. Venture can basically... be pretty low as well. Yeah, but it, it, they're still better than the fucking um, blood mages. Uh, maybe by half a point on average, but not by that much necessarily. Still better. So, how long do you wish to recover? I need to know if the Earthbound will have built up his first dot of cult and worship by the time you get back. Uh, I vote for at least three days of recovery. Yeah. Three days? Well, that's enough to yeah. refill the rage meters, at least. Yeah, it'll get me to half willpower. Okay. It can get me to max, but I need to re recover some fucking Gnosis. Uh, you yeah, will Gnosis essentially problem. be helped with one point each. Beyond that, you can attempt to meditate. I'll even yeah. give you a minus one for doing it at a decent strength set on the meditation difficulty. Alrighty. Does the Shadow Lord want anything of me right now? He just wants your pack to get its shit together and fix this problem with the vamps now. As in... Well, let's say two weeks. Fix it within two weeks, if at all possible. Because there's other shit that needs attention and can't have this kind of crap. Like a front open so close to them. Especially with them knowing where the Sept is. Something needs to be done. They need to be either killed or... S any kind of solution, really, that works. Mm. How much time did I give the okay. Premier after, before I blew him up? Can I increase like the brawl? One day? Eight. Two days? Uh, uh, five. Brawl to five. Uh, sure, we're getting close to the end. Go ahead and max yourself out there. Okay. Yeah, you... Hell, probably at this point you're fucked enough on... Uh, stuff like honor and glory that you effectively count as rank 1. Until you recover it. Uh, meditation is Wits Enigmas at 7 with the modifi modifier from the Sept. Yes. Yep. So I'm getting an intelligence point while we're resting. Sure. Okay. Alright, there's three points of Gnosis back. Does anyone else wish to meditate? Yep. Okay, go ahead and make your rolls. Wits Enigmas. That's a point for you. You know, Chuckle, uh, given how you've changed, I think a lot of your old Red Talon friends are a little bit more reluctant to hang with you. Mm -hmm. It's something something about you smelling weird. Uh, 
Okay. Aww. You can try a second time. The difficulty just goes up by one to an eight. No. I'm only down. I'm only down one. I don't. You shouldn't be down one because the silver would have drained your pool, essentially resetting it. What? Yeah. They had enough Are silver piled on zero? you in the cells to essentially keep you at. put you in a state where you could hold on to no gnosis while you were in there. So you would have had to start recovering oh. it from zero. That's pretty fucking bad. terrible. Bad. Yes, they wanted to fuck your ability to escape, and they know about stepping sideways. Alright, there you go, Jack. Get three, more, get back three of those gnosis points. But you have one from the uh, assistance from the sap. So, not a botch. Not a botch. And do you want some more, Laura? Um, can I try again? Sure. Sure you can. It just goes up to an 8 instead of a 7. And you can try a third time as well and make it go to a 9. I'm not sure if I want to try that. <laughs> no? Okay. Let's just make sure the demon book is open. Just unrelated reasons, really. I mean... <laughs> At the nine chances aren't that good. So, count one worship of love one and refill fate by two points for that. There we go. Now, is there anything he can do to let you know he hasn't forgotten about you? Let's see. Uh, boring, boring, boring. Actually, he does have that. Let's see. That actually seems... Can I get a point of willpower to my XP? Sure, you can. Yay. Is that... Do I get the temporary too, or is it just max? Uh, if you're buying a new point, that point starts filled, yes. Okay, nice. I feel like it will, will become important in the future. Don't know why. <laughs> okay. Aru. Give me mm -hmm. a... At the end of those three days, give me a roll of danger sense at seven. Okay. Okay. Damn. So you have no idea that it's about to happen. And suddenly in the area around you just Well, it's it's like an artillery strike on the very old, very respected trees around you, as they suddenly start erupting into splinters. Son of a bitch. <laughs> so, what can I... <laughs> There's just Honestly, pieces I... of it that uh, are smoking as they fall around you. They don't hurt you, but there's just this rain of splinters and sawdust around you for a few moments. Why? What have we done to deserve this? Existed, obviously. 
So I'm sort of going to. I'm probably actually in beast form right now since we're at the sept. Mm hmm. So I, I'd sort of whip my head around to try and see if I couldn't uh, see what did it. Uh, you don't see much at all in terms of what could have caused it, but you do a couple of the guardian spirits of the place briefly materialize and look around confused and alarmed as well. Uh, well, if I can't see anything, then uh, sense the worm. Actually, that worm location cover. should be at... Uh... Okay, roll to sense that. All Go right, ahead. Um, I'm assuming you wanted six, uh, and then you decide. Uh, make it at six. There's definitely corruption in the air. And then you just feel yourself picked up off the ground and slammed against a tree as the very air turns against you and just slams into you with the force of six points of lethal damage. Oh. <laughs> Someone's going, uh, someone right now is entering uh, war form. I'm, yeah, I'm just... it's about this point which I'm, at which I'm going to enter into war form. Oh my god, I was not expecting that at all. I am also entering war form. You should have that. You should I have that. the pack either. Okay, now bad. then, let's do something else fucked up that will make you sad and angry at the same time. I hate Earth um, Isn't Earth there a howl that... I deserve to die in hell. Isn't there a howl that uh like says that we're under attack or something? Oh yes, it's already going up. <laughs> there are people okay. around. And you know you just see Coyote appear in front of you and his just face is scrunched up in an intense internal struggle. It's like opening and closing his mouth, eyes turning completely black and then back to normal. <laughs> This is just barely holding on. No! Yeah, not Coyote. <laughs> coyote. Can, can we help him? Can we for him this? What? Um, he's having us roll it at six. Uh, also, would I have to roll to shift, or...? Uh, if you spend a rage point, you can insta-shift. Yeah, I'm just gonna burn a rage point at this point, because we're clearly under attack. Something needs to be done. The only question is, what can we do? So, do I sense something more, or...? Uh, yes, you do at this point, because the crap is building up in there and it's getting easier. Uh, there is something powerful just casually smashing through the wards you have around here and reaching out to fuck with you. Can I sense where it is? And not specifically, the best you can get is the general direction, which might or might not be from the city you came from. Are you say how long is it to the city, did you say again? 300 kilometers? Uh, it might be something like that. Or God, as I said before, fuck Earthbound, they're OP as shit. This one can fast travel, which is the problem. As I said... Fuck Earthbound. They are OP as shit. There's a reason why they make pretty damn good enemies. And then, Aru, you see the what face the of your totem just twist and change into something that's just like this... It's like a shadow given form, and at the same time it's like a pit into darkness and death. Hello, little doggy. I'm so disappointed you went to your little doghouse. You come and play. I'm bored with you. I'll attack it in war form right the fuck now. Okay, roll to attack. Okay, um, brawl, six brawl. Uh, yes. Difficulty six. Difficulty six. Die, you piece of shit. Die. Roll for damage. Uh, 
Wow. <laughs> Whatever. Are you fucking me? Okay. It just turns, nice. looks you in the eye, and uh, just grins. Um, it just says, "Sit." Roll willpower to resist. I wonder why I thought willpower would be important. <laughs> Also, roll to like soak. You also need to roll to soak four points of bashing thing, damage. Yeah. Yes. All right, this shit. <laughs> because yeah, Fucking difficulty six shit. was it right? Yes. Oh, there's a reason why I utterly detest the demons. Yeah, I resist. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> now the stamina roll. <laughs> Nope, can't so for shit. <laughs> you just fall to your knees, clutching at your head. Fuck you. I mean, the Earthbound got what it wanted in the end. Can I attack it? Go ahead, make an attack roll. <laughs> Watch me miss, because obviously I suck. Hey, apparently I don't always. Actually, I have one more die than that, because... Plus one. This is something else. This could be good for you. Even gonna lower the difficulty. Okay. I had to reroll because I have extra. Okay. Reroll, meanwhile, I'm gonna roll the mm. soak. I did reroll. Okay. That's the reroll I rolled. Okay. Well, I need a damage roll. Either way. Yes. Damage. Okay, Bye. your job. claw passes through it, the face immediately vanishes, and you just see the shocked eyes of your totem as he blows away on the wind. <laughs> I mean, 99% expected. And not at all surprising. I love that bit of silence me. there, though. That was a good moment. It was me, the sound of me sighing at the heavily OP as fuck Earthbound. Because Earthbound are OP as fuck. Still. Well, like Epic said, when you let it know that you can sense it watching you, it got interested in you, and now you're boring Itaru. What do you think is the expected reaction there? I, I I think that the uh, the Earthbound has to die. <laughs> I mean that was already a thing. It's just a matter of how hard are we fucked, and the answer was always incredibly, because Earthbound are OPS shit. As I'm by. Point. Yeah, I, I think I think this was my um my I think this is my craft law moment. <laughs> Almost. You need to shank a bitch. One. Yeah, we one because we die. Well, you can still sense your connection to the totem. He's just... This ha probably has happened once or twice. He's just discorporated. He'll probably be back in a day or two. I do not wish to hear vile things from the vile spirit that controlled our totem. You know... At this point, the uh, Uktena elder shows up with a, oh, God's fucking damn it look on their face, essentially. Yeah, the spirit you talked about earlier, elder, it's awake, it's powerful. We told you this. I mean, this was nothing unexpected, they had heard legends yeah. about it. And the fact that it yeah, seems they... to have taken an interest in me is annoying me. You know, <laughs> I want everyone to roll perception alertness. Uh, since you're distracted, make it a 7 for everyone except Jackalore. You can roll at 6. Mm -hmm. Uh, 
Of course I get three successes. Nope, of course. Want. Of course. Okay. Front I don't think you want shadow. to roll. You just notice the shadow lord just off in the distance among the trees, leaning in a uh, shadow. Out of clear sight, just casually watching you with a speculative look in his eye. <laughs> Raygood suggest we should leave and go do something about this. I mean, you could try and ping it, Aruman. Shadow know it's, is not good. I don't know it's us. Celestial or True Name, though, and I don't want to draw its attention. It just keeps looking at us. You have, at so the I mean, very you know least, seen its thrall, though. I think but do we know we've seen its thrall? Didn't you just see the, uh, already see the, it's fucking, whatever the, it's, what it, it, the spirit is inside? You what did see its face. It was speaking through your totem, so it's not exactly a clear image, but yes, you do have a rough image of it. So... Does this mean roll for true name? No, you do not have the expertise to decipher that. Vampires yeah. with high occult, they have formal magic training. You're more shamanistic. Yeah, I think you're not, but... Uh... Yeah, the, you don't have the tools to decipher this, really. And certainly not from a rough, distorted image of a face, no less. But what you can do is uh, search it out. Try try and find where that uh, that, that goddamn thing is. I, I may as well actually ping it. Let's let's see how well his uh his, his fucking ability to hide from uh hide from my my find everything radar is. Okay. And the resist on that was something like with stealth, right? Um, actually, let me double check that. I think it was, I think it was with stealth. Mm -hmm. Well, either way, he's not uh, trying to hide right now, so. Yeah, I mean, this is stealth. Okay. So, yeah, you sense him, but it, he's not on this plane. He's on an adjacent one, and uh, racing back in the direction of the city. Quickly, too. I'm pretty sure I can tell I can't catch up to him. It's no fucking way. It's like, yeah. mile per turn kind of thing. Yeah. Because apocalyptic form is bullshit. Doesn't even Mostly have to be an apocalyptic apocalypse. form if... The, he actually is stupid enough to have the troll carry his reliquary around. Yeah. On yeah. the plus side, th this does mean that I can now track it down. Sure, if you want to. Remember what I said about this probably being my craft law moment? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go over there and say hi. I'm not sure you have enough explosives, Zaru. <laughs> I don't think I need explosives. I just need to bring the people straight to it. Just need people to bring the people who have the uh, who have the actual training to him. I mean, you can. I think they might be a party wipe, but go for it if that's how you want to wrap this up. I mean, that's but mostly it's part of uh, yeah. it because Earth Order bullshit. Yeah. Yes, but the fighting stopped. It's bored now. And you were such good entertainment before, so it figured it would poke you. I mean, that's kind of what the Tremere were trying to do with craft. <laughs> <laughs> if you see, it didn't end well for them. Really <laughs> I mean, it didn't end well for craft either, but <laughs> you can't argue that it didn't work. The Airborne certainly enjoyed it. The Earth I'm sure it did. 
The Earthman got a C4 right next to his face. Why, why would he, did he enjoy that? Because now he's free. And I mean, re and uh, perfect reliquaries are bullshit, and even imperfect reliquaries are still probably bullshit. That explosion, the fact that they damaged it, that was essentially an automatic, it wakes. Yeah, it's like smacking a sleeping person in the face. It's like, ow! Oh wait, shit, I'm free! <laughs> So it's all my spirit Good going message. to the underworld. I was like, yeah. thank you, little yeah. guy. Good job. Much. And I'm like, oh, shit, no. I'm sort of going to growl under under my breath. I have, <laughs> I can find you now. <laughs> Roll luck, Diaru. Oh, yeah. yeah. Let's see. Today. <laughs> Aru dies. But the die doesn't want him to die yet. That <laughs> is gonna have to be enough. He would have probably been watching you, but he's watching Carnage in another part of the set right now. Yeah. He was he was watching me, but then he went off, but then so, then Carnage was happening because like this is probably the last aftershocks of the death of the Zima Sea. And he's like, ooh, Carnage, and he looked away. Oh no, it was mostly just, you know, watching Dan scurry after he kicked the uh, anthill. Yeah. This was the moment when he wasn't focusing on me. Yep. <laughs> and on that note, let's split the video, because the party has a choice how they wish to finish. 